ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the One Middlesex Staff Awards 2019. Woohoo! <laughs> I'm Faye Barker, presenter and reporter for ITV News, but most of all a proud alumna of Middlesex University. <laughs> it's going to take all night if you keep clapping, but I'm not complaining. <laughs> Now, the middle sex we see around us today does feel a world away from when I was a student back in the 90s. Now, my time studying performing arts was spent mostly in the beautiful grounds of Trent Park, one of many smaller campuses that were scattered around North London back then that used to make up this university. And I mean, back then, Trent Park had the feel of a smaller college. It specialised in drama, music, media and dance, as many of you here, I'm sure, know. And I had a very happy time there, making lifelong friends and learning lifelong skills. But things move on, and Middlesex has, of course, moved on too. And when I first visited this campus only a year or so ago, I was really, really impressed. Um, having everything together now on one site does give this university a wonderful feel of community. And I think this will only enhance the experience of all the students here. But always at this university's core is the staff. And I know that from my own experience, students are guided by some really brilliant leaders in all their specialist fields. Now, Middlesex University's success is a direct result of the vision, dedication, and hard work of the staff. The One Middlesex Staff Awards are one way in which the contributions of all of those people are celebrated, and these awards identifying and celebrating excellence. Now, staff get to nominate and reward the people and the teams that they think make some of the greatest impact. And as a result, we'll all get to hear tonight inspiring stories of the work of Middlesex colleagues. Now, we'll discover examples of excellence, people, and their teams that go that extra mile and find out about the hard work and the commitment of academic and professional services. Now, for the 2019 awards, nearly 150 people took the time to make a nomination and to write citations. Now this year there are five award categories and an amazing talented lineup of 43 finalists. Now the finalists are a mixture of teams and individuals drawn from all parts of the university community. Every finalist has achieved a great deal and is a winner in the eyes of the university. Now to be recognized for outstanding work first by your colleagues, then by a panel of your peers is no mean feat. And I'm delighted to welcome all of our finalists tonight and also friends, family, and colleagues who are all here to support you. We do have a packed schedule to get through, but before we get to the awards themselves, I am going to hand you over to the Vice Chancellor, Professor Tim Blackman, who will say a few words on this, our second annual One Middlesex Staff Award Ceremony. Now, many of the finalists did receive multiple nominations, and I'm told it was one of the most difficult categories to judge, and perhaps the most fitting to end on tonight. So this award received 56 nominations, so the judging panel had a pretty tough task to choose this final lineup of finalists. So the four finalists for this award of Colleague of the Year in alphabetical order are Joe Fulgoni, Next is Mehmet Karamanoglu. Also, Sophie Knowles. And last but by no means least, William Lakin. So, the winner of the award for Colleague of the Year 2019 is. I feel we need a drum roll for this one. This is a biggie, isn't it? Here we go. <laughs> the award for Colleague of the Year 2019 is Mehmet Karamanoglu. Mehmet, 